I've been watching a few videos on how to nickel plate on YouTube and some of them seem very simple too simple in fact so I thought I'd have a little experiment just to see if it's the expertise of the people doing it or it is in fact that simple so I've started here with um, white vinegar and a spoonful of salt in it to this I'm adding two nickel electrodes this is in the form of a nickel ribbon that I got cheap off of eBay as far as I know what you do now is you get an old mobile phone charger connect positive to one strip and negative to the other and leave it overnight the solution should then turn green with a deposit of nickel acetate my idea is to bung this thing together as simply as possible and do exactly what they say on YouTube without worrying about temperature, voltage or anything like that and just see what the results are like if there's any result at all then it's worth further investigation so we'll see how it goes here you can see the nickel strip is gassing quite happily if anything I think the voltage might be a bit high the next morning I decided to continue with the experiment I got an old piece of copper uh, copper tube and polished it brought it up to a nice shine on the buffing wheel and then washed the residue off with carb cleaner I'm going to try and plate on top of this again doing the minimum of work and see what results I get the solution should have been green but it doesn't look that green to me but we'll give it a go anyway I put a fresh strip of nickel on the positive side and a bit of tube was connected to the negative side I then held it in the solution to see if there was any reaction as you can see the bubbles are venting quite nicely definitely contamination in the bottom of the jar but we'll muck about and see what happens after about 30 seconds I removed the copper just to see if there was any deposit on it don't know if you can tell but there is definitely a sheen to it there can't be much nickel on it at this point but I'm already impressed with the finish so I shall bung it back in and leave it for three or four minutes just to see what happens after about five minutes it came out the tank the bright finish had gone and was replaced with a dull grey finish a bit like the zinc plating I do in the zinc plating bath that usually points to a too high a current and the deposit going on too quick but as I say we shall keep going here you can see me polishing it with uh, Solvo Autosol and I have to say I'm totally impressed with the finish once it was polished up it required very little finishing to get this shine on it and this is without hardly any surface preparation or any time and care in preparing the solution it was just a slap together job I am very impressed and will investigate a lot further thanks for watching